Hi everybody, it's Andrew Rotter here, and today I will be doing my second fidget spinner collection video. Now, I now the first fidget spinner collection video I did, I did it at my Marfa's Vineyard house because I was on vacation, and now I'm doing my first video he fidget spinner collection video here in my Mitchell dorm. So yeah, anyways, because I'm in college, so yeah, let's do the so let's show these off. So um, the newest fidget spinners I have are um this. Turquoise colored one, which um, I think I might have mentioned this in my last in my comparing video, but I'll just I'll just mention it again. I believe I got this at J and M's or CVS maybe or somewhere. I'm not sure where I got this, but I did get it at one of those stores, and then, or I think I got this one at J and M's. And then the next fidget I have is is this purple fidget spinner, which is a metallic one. I got this one at J&M's as well as this one, I believe. So yeah, it's nice and shiny. That's what I like about this one. It's got like a, it's nice and shiny. That's what I like about it. So yeah, and the third fidget spinner I got is a Mitchell College fidget spinner. And I got this one, of course, at the bookstore because my college is a bookstore. So yeah, that's where I got this one. And this is one of the few fidget spinners where where there's, it has openings, because the ones that have openings are, besides this one, are this one, this one, um, that, this one right there, the Mohonk one where I'm pointing at, this one, and that's it, and speaking of the glow in the dark fish spinner, um, hang on, sorry, I was just putting the camera down, anyways, um, speaking of this one, um, you'll, you'll notice something different about it, watch this. See how it didn't spin that long? Well, I'll tell you, um, um, uh, me, my friend had a, um, monster, me and my friend were having a monster energy drink, and I spilled this on the fish there, so that's why it's kind of making a different sound. I mean, it's still, although I did spill something on this, it's, spill it on there, it still glows in the dark, which I'm not going to do right now, because the only, because this thing will only glow in the dark in total darkness. And you know what's funny about this fidget spinner? This is one of the few spinners where we can take the pieces off. Watch this. Watch this. Here's what happens when you take these pieces off the fidget spinner. It'll, it'll make a difference. See, look. You can actually... Now there's a hole in it. Watch, the, watch what happens when I spin it. It kind of spins awkwardly because it's missing a piece. Now let's take the second piece off and see what happens when it does it. See, it doesn't spin that long when it's missing two pieces. And it doesn't spin... I mean, when it's missing one of these metal pieces, um, it's only spinning for like a few seconds. Now, now let's see what happens when I take out the third piece. Here's what happens. See, look, it doesn't make any. It barely makes a sound because there's no metal part in it. No metal. Now, anyways, um, anyways, parents, if you ever have a fish spinner, please do not let your kid. If if you ever have a fish spinner where the metal parts fall off, please do not let your kids touch these because they may swallow them and that would be bad. Because these could be easily swallowed by little kids, so don't let that happen. So anyways, now I'm just putting these back in. I know, this is kind of funny. You can also spin the top on this, which... You could barely spin the top on this since I spilled something on it, but it's a, it's more quieter after what happened, and I'm actually happy about it. I Me, mean, I'm sad when I spilled something on it, but I'm happy that's a little quieter. Anyways, so yeah... Um, some of these you can take the metal parts out, some you cannot. I mean, the other fish spinners I have have like metal in between the circles. And this one has like orange stuff covering the metal on it. So yeah, you, so yeah, the fish spinners, like most of them have metal on these parts, some of them just have openings. Which is kind of funny. And um and then and, and then and the speaking of this fidget spinner, it's one of the few fidget spinners to have a logo on it that I have. Because the ones that have the logo on it are, have logos on it are this one, um, this one, and that one. So those are the four fidget spinners that have the logo on it. So yeah, just those three fidget spinners are new because, um, although I might have, I might have mentioned that this is new in a comparing video, but I decided to just mention it again for those who need a reminder. So yeah, so these three are new. Yeah, these three right here where I'm pointing at it. So yes. Anyways, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, thank you for watching. Bye.